Hi and welcome to my new episode. This is the review of the app for Android called Clean Master. When we open it up, you'll see on the left hand side you have the SD card with uh, memory free and memory used and on the right hand side is the device storage. Uh, at the bottom you'll see you've got these four main options, the junk folder, the privacy, the tasks and the app manager. If you click on junk folder you have your standard uh, scan and you also have your advanced scan which comes up with all your big files that you have, all your capture, all your leftovers, all your temporary files and once it's scanned at the bottom the clean button comes up with how much uh, space you can save once you hit it. Just wait for it to load up a bit more. Didn't take this long yesterday, but I've wrecked it a bit. There we go. Advanced cleaning can detect more potential junk files. Yep. And it's really nice and easy to see. You've got things like your video files, which I don't want to clean, but it's good to, that the icons stay the same. And you've got your comic book icons here. And as you scroll down, it's just easy to see and understand, which is great. The graphics are nice, clean, and simple, along with the input. See, junk files, 442. Anyway, go back. And then on the privacy tab, you've got all your accounts down here, which you can also clean. Uh, wouldn't really recommend it unless you've got loads of accounts that you want to get rid of. Um, because if you do clean them, you've got to go back in through them, log in, sign in, do all that again. And it's a pain and takes up time. So I wouldn't really do that, but it's good that it's there. We've also got the tasks options down at the bottom. This shows you what tasks are happening. Uh, you can also clean them all up quite nicely. Uh, so lets you know how much memory you'll save once you've done so. And you've also got on here the app manager as well. This has a lovely little thing because it shows you all the apps that you've installed. And you can uninstall or back them up. And at the bottom, when you scroll all the way down, click pre-install apps. And it comes up with all the apps that are pre-installed and that come with the tablet. You might need it rooted for this option. Mine already is. So, I don't know. If you did need it, it'll tell you. Um, you've also got your backup option of your installed and non-installed files. And you can clean them, but I'm not going to. And then another feature about this, and this is the only one I've found with this feature. I've tried some other cleaning tools, but none have been uh, as concise and coherent as this was automatically. There was no tutorial. You can go in and you can figure it out easily. Um, yeah, so you've got all your apps down here that you can click on and you can also move them to your external storage so that they're not always clicking up your data on your Android which I think is a fantastic thing to have uh, at the top you'll also notice that there is a little gift button just here if you click on it an advert comes up for a free download it's better than having it in the middle of the screen or in the bottom or as a pop up You've also got your settings up in that corner as well. The task reminder, junk reminder, frequency size, catch, language, um, improvements to be made on this program so you can have it on so it will send out data, which is nice. And that is the overall review of the Clean Master for Android. It's definitely a 5 out of 5. I've already rated it with a 5 star rating. Because of how clean, concise, coherent it is. The input's easy, the output is understandable, and the graphics are clean and slick. So yeah, 
definitely one if you want to keep your Android system running smoothly to download and use at least once a week on. Anyway, thanks for watching my video. Uh, subscribe, share and enjoy. And if you don't like it, then feel free to leave a trolling comment because I'm sure I will not care. Thank you very much.